five reasons why the narcissist chose you. The narcissist picked you out of a crowd. They chose you deliberately and carefully. They were drawn to you because there were certain characteristics they liked about you. You had characteristics that they lacked within themselves. One, loyalty. They chose you because they knew you were loyal. They knew that you would support them for the good times and the bad. They knew that you would invest in them. They knew that you would try to sustain the relationship, even when things start to change. They knew you would get everything you have, without expecting anything in return. And they were drawn to that, because they knew that when things go bad for them, you'd still be there to regulate their emotions to give them money without pressuring them to do or be better and that's exactly what they want they want someone who will always be there for them no matter what they do to them someone who will always be by their side But it isn't good for you because you will still be fighting for them even when they're doing everything they can to destroy you, which is what they want and expect. Because it's one of the main reasons why they chose you. But just because they expect you to be loyal to them, it doesn't mean they're going to be loyal to you. They will throw you under the, under the bus at any chance they get. They will cause you to suffer in order to save themselves and gain a personal advantage. They will criticize, blame and punish you. They will deliberately sacrifice you to get what they want. They will lie. They will cheat. And they will steal and they won't feel any remorse. As long as they get what they want, they won't care about what happens to you. Two, empathy. You show concern for the sufferings and misfortunes of other people. You wish to help them. You can't just watch them struggling or in pain. You feel like you have a duty to help them out. You will listen to people's problems for hours without judging or blaming them. And you will do anything you can to help them because you want to see people happy and successful. And you don't think any less of them just because they're down. You accept them for who they are. You see them as your equal, regardless of where they are in life. And this is why the narcissist chose you. Because they wanted someone who cares. They knew that your empathy and compassion would oblige you to take action. They knew that it would make you do anything to make their situation better. They knew that they could take advantage of you by making you feel bad because they know you want to be a good person. They know that these things matter to you. They know that you don't want to see them down. Even after everything they've done to you. Which is exactly what they want. They want someone to feel sorry for them. Someone who will make great efforts to make them better. And it was easy for them to identify that in you 
because it's something they don't have. They lack empathy and compassion, but they're very good at pretending to care. By imitating how they see you or other people respond to people who are in pain or distress. But if you've ever needed assistance from them, you will know that it's fake. Three, authenticity. They chose you because of your authenticity, because you're real and true. You're a genuine person. You don't judge people. You don't form an opinion or conclusion about anyone because you understand that we all have flaws and imperfections. We are all imperfect. We all make mistakes. So you're not hard on anyone if things don't turn out as you expected. Instead, you choose to take responsibility. You choose to see how you could have acted differently so that you can learn from your mistakes. You're able to be vulnerable so you can connect to people on a deeper level. A narcissist notice this. It arouses their curiosity and interest because they can't comprehend how you're able to be so real and confident. They're envious of how you're able to move through life in this way and they're shocked by how people love you for who you are rather than you having to put on an act or by trying to be something you're not. You could just be yourself and people gravitate towards you but our authenticity is often what sets us back when we are dealing with narcissists because we tend to assume that they are real too. We believe what they are displaying to us because it's difficult for us to comprehend how someone could lie about who they really are and this is what they use against you. Because in the beginning they mirrored your likes and interests they acted like they were on the same page and by the time you had realized that it was all a lie it was too late you had already invested in them so they already knew it was going to be difficult for you to let go because they knew you were an authentic person they knew you established a real attachment to them and they know it's not so easy for a real person to sever ties with someone Four, resilience. The narcissist picked you because of your capacity to withstand adversity and bounce back from difficult life events. You're tough. You're able to take responsibility. You're able to deal with the consequences. Not only for yourself, but also for the people you care about. You remain calm and opposed and ready to do what is necessary, especially when met with adversity and crisis. You hold everything together. Without you, everything would fall apart. And that is what drew the narcissist to you, because they know that things aren't going to go well for them. But your resilience tells them that you won't leave when things get tough. Five, forgiveness. They picked you because you're able to release feelings of resentment and vengeance. You're able to let go of your anger towards them after they hurt you. You're able to remain positive and move forward instead of seeking revenge, which is exactly what they want. They want you to overlook their wrongdoing. They want you to accept them even though they're not really sorry for what they did because they're going to keep doing what they do. 
they're going to keep hurting you. So they need to be with someone who is going to forgive them. Someone who isn't going to hold a grudge. Which can cause problems for you. Because you should only forgive someone if they intend on changing their behavior. But the narcissist will take advantage of your forgiveness and they will expect you to forgive them for everything. But if you make a mistake, they won't forgive you. They will hold it against you and they will use it to justify what they do. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. Share your thoughts in the comment section. Hit the subscribe button to receive the notifications. If you would like to support the channel, you can donate at paypal.me slash narcsurvivor. You can book a one-on-one -on -one with me on my website. It's narcsurvivor.co.uk. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.